to my YouTube channel G Tech the Ultimate Solutions. Today I'll introduce a kids electric car. Let's take a ride. to make this project you need a car chassis just like a, a kids car it's it is uh, if it is plastic and metal that is not the matter but a car chassis you need you need a battery bar 12 volt and 7 ampere and what more and after that you need a gear motor to control the speed i am using 150 rpm motor and speed controller to the accelerator as the accelerator you can use and light and buzzer and few wire also need to make this car now i'll discuss one by one let's start about the project here you can see the dashboard in just like a other car you can see the dashboard here i'm using a mosfet to start the car that means as an accelerator i'm using is it simply switch on and off this you can see this red color button if you touch and press this then the car will run so and this is the horn button i'm using a buzzer to get the horn sound and here in case of switch i'm using a single simple mosfet i'll tell you the circuit later to see the next part and this this switch is to move forward and backward just like a gear i'm just changing the polarity to ch change the motor polarity so that we can move forward and backward just uh, dpdt i'm using here friends you can see here the bottom side of this car this electronic car it is 100 percent homemade and now we can see the speed controller i'm just changing the voltage of this motor so that i can in increase or decrease the speed this is basically we are using as an accelerator and you can adjust it according to your requirement because kids can ride in very high speed that's why you can adjust this speed this part this module which is better to say model is available in local market also this is the main part of this car basically this is the power source you can see let me clear the picture i am using here 12 volt sealed lead this battery and it is 12 ampere battery but for your information you can use 12 volt 7 ampere car battery also for better result i am using here and it is uh, i am having this battery that's why I'm using for this project but you can change the battery ampere but if you take the big too big battery in size so we can't fit it in the kids car so it is better maximum 12 ampere or 7 ampere is recommended now you can see the another important part of this car this is the main gearbox here I'm using 555 motor and it is 150 rpm you have to set this geared motor with a metal frame and according to the card fittings you need to set it properly and obviously you fit fix it and it is very important to fix it very carefully because it will heat to take the entire load of this car so if you fix properly then only you can handle this car 
otherwise it will not run for long time friend this is a simple charging point it is very easy you know that and uh, you look it carefully see i am using a diode to block the reverse bias and also using a led to check the power whether it is available or not it is for your confirmation to make this project very attractive and attractive to kids too i am using a here a buzzer 12 volt buzzer as a horn and one blue color led friends you can check i am using here a dpdt switch see i will show you the at the bottom of this uh, picture you can see this is the dpdt switch i am using this to change the polarity of this geared motor so that i can move forward and backward as well and here i am using dc booster and this is the main switch through which i am operating the motor speed and the movement let's check the, the check this curve from the bottom side once again and this is the main design i can show you the individual wire but uh, if you need the diagram i can provide you you just comment i will provide you friend i have introduced all parts of this car now i'll practically check and i'll show you how it's work see this is the main button main button means if you press this there will be a switch i'm using a mosfet here to switch on and off as it is working as a touch switch and see you can see this wheel is working now and this is the controller i already told you um, i can change the speed now if i press this button then this wheel will move very slowly because it was the speed is already reduced now see you can change according to your choice any speed you can choose now it is moving forward very slowly now i am changing the speed now see how fast it is so this is the main controller and in front of this car i am using a headlight also to make it more attractive and see different colors are colors in the dashboard and back side of this car you can see the red light also they fix it it looks very nice and uh, here i am i'll show you the dpdt how it is working i'm changing the movement of this car see now it is moving backward slowly i'm changing the speed it will it's, it's moving very fast see now i'll change the movement of this car just see okay now i'll change it through this switch okay now see this movement in which direction it is moving it's moving in the forward direction i'm sure this video will help you to make your own car and if you think that your child is very special and you need to give something which he can he or she can enjoy you can make this it is very interesting and it is very easy to make in your home and i'm sure that your kid will enjoy this so friends if you like this video please like and share with us share your feedback your comments so that we can make next project with full energy and hope thank you